research tools for thesis writing. For literature review, you can use Google Scholar, Web of Science, Scopus, and JS Talk. For reference management, you can use Zotero, Mendeley, and EndNote. Writing tools for documentation, Microsoft Word, Latex, Google Docs, and make sure don't ever forget your journey in. Before we go to the other segments, these three segments of literature review, reference management and document and so on will follow through your entire journey of research and thesis writing. And once this entire three things completed, next step, very, very crucial, your proofreading and paraphrasing tools, which I would highly recommend only Grammarly or human-based. For data collection and management, you can stick with SurveyMonkey, Google Sheet, Microsoft Excel, SQL databases, and MongoDB. Once all the data collection done, the next step is data analysis and visualizations. You can use Smart PLS, MOS, SPSS, MATLAB, or Python. Experimentation and simulation part. You can use software like MATLAB, Simulink, and LabVIEW. Now, how do you perform the research drawing and visualization? You can use Microsoft Visio, draw.io or you can stick with canva one of these this entire ecosystem of thesis development journal development comes down to collaboration and communication between you your fellow students your supervisor and examiners so microsoft word review tab if you don't know what is review tab you can ask in the comment i will explain to you i will show you how to use it microsoft word review tab to communicate with your supervisor for corrections and submission so with that thank you very much share this video please go and share this video with all the research students out there make sure you like and follow